Chief executives and general managers are at or near the top of the chain of command. And while they may ultimately report to a board of directors or the stockholders, they have a great deal of power within their organizations. With power comes a tremendous amount of responsibility. People in these positions are expected to provide both a vision of the future and the leadership to achieve it. If they succeed, they may be richly rewarded. But if they fail, they often lose their jobs. People become top executives by working their way up, either in a single company or by holding jobs of ever-increasing responsibilities in a variety of firms. Like politicians preparing to run for office years in advance, it is not uncommon for individuals to begin grooming themselves for positions while still in college. Not everyone can handle the pressure and the high-risk, high-reward nature of these positions. But those who can usually find their jobs to be among the most satisfying in the business world.